Barbie Mamas, welcome back to my channel. Thanks so much for stopping by. If you're new here, welcome. I'm so glad you're here. I'm back with another try on haul for you today. It is Torrid again because, like I said before, it's my favorite and you guys loved the last one. So I wanted to stop in over the weekend and see what they had for the upcoming holiday season, maybe get some holiday inspo. And I was not disappointed. Holy baby cry. I was definitely not disappointed. They had so many cute things, all in just reds and greens and blacks and grays and like every perfect winter color and texture. I got some velvet. I got velvet. I don't think I own anything velvet, but that all changed. Sorry guys, it's Monday morning. I'm in my robe. Makes me feel like like one of those sassy housewives. Like I should have a basket of laundry and some white wine. Just like Okay, I'm stupid. Anyway, so before we get into the haul, um, I wanted to show you the two things that I got on clearance because they are not in the try-on. Um, I got this belt here. It looks um Kind of like a corset and it's real stretchy it's got this like thick band and um snap enclosures on the back and i thought it would be like super cute with like a really tight short like bodycon dress or like even if i'm wearing like tunics and leggings um i've been eyeballing it for a while but this time it was on sale so i couldn't pass it up it was $15.98 on sale. I got it in a double zero. And then I also scored. <sighs> Happy Monday. I also scored these little dangle earrings. They like, they're a little like, silvery plate type dangle earrings. They were um, $8.98 and the clearance was buy one get one free so these were free. And actually they'd be cute with the hairstyle I'm rocking today. Okay so that's what I got on clearance. I also got two of the tops from the try on. I'll tell you when we get there but everything was so cute I literally would have bought pretty much everything that I tried on but <sighs> budget <laughs> so um I'll let you know which of the tops that I got everything was perfect let's get into it <laughs> okay so starting with the outfit that I came in with I have my sky high skinny jeans also from Torrid um, just a plain white tee and this jacket that I got last year from Torrid and my burgundy Walmart boots that you saw in the Walmart try-on. Okay, this first top is one of the ones that came home with me. It was a open shoulder crisscross detail very soft and stretchy. I think it was their, it was basically the same thing as their super soft tunics, just with the crisscross detail on the side. So it had a bit of a rounded hem at the bottom, which is very flattering. And it was nice and flowy and kind of floated away from the body without being oversized. So super soft, super comfortable, and still looking dressy. And I just tried it on with the jeans that I came in with. I got this top in a size double zero and it was $38.90. So I realized I don't show enough professional clothing for my working mamas and I know there's a lot of you out there. So I tried on this more professional type outfit on. It's a gray peplum blazer and the stretch ponty pants, which I picked in 
the plaid color because again we're going for holiday here this outfit basically screams holiday work party <laughs> um there's my rick and morty socks very very fashionable um i would absolutely pair this with like a real sparkly blingy type necklace really um dress it up and like a real cute black pump or even some boots the fit of everything was pretty good the pants were my normal size but they definitely suck you in like big time <laughs> there's a little bit of a muffin top you can see because they were pretty tight bearable but definitely tight and the blazer was perfect Okay, so moving along, up next we have this plum baby doll style dress. You can't tell, but it was almost fuzzy. So it was like so, so soft. It was amazing to feel. And it had pockets, which yay, everybody loves pockets in their dresses. It was above the knee, enough so that you could wear like knee high boots and have it not clash. It would also be cute with like short booties and tights. And since it had like a higher neckline, I would definitely do some sort of um, statement necklace or something longer to really play off of it. The arms are supposed to be full length, but on me, they almost were like three quarter. I don't know if that was intentional or I'm just tall and the sleeves are short, but it didn't bother me too much. I got this in a double zero and the price was $64.90. All right, and next we have another professional type outfit. It is a Harper top, which is basically just a blouse with functioning buttons that go halfway down, two pocket details on the chest area and three quarter length sleeves. I have it tucked in, but it is shorter in the front and longer at the back. And I tucked it into this black Ponty pencil skirt. It has a lace-up detail on the side with a little bit of a slit. They didn't have my size in the skirt, so I tried on a size one, which was definitely too big, but I just had to try it on because it was so cute. If it would have been in my size, I definitely would have bought it, even though I don't have anywhere to wear it to. It was just so perfect. And I definitely would have paired this outfit also with a pair of pumps. I got the top in a double zero. It was $44.90. And the skirt was, again, a 1X, and it was $54.90. Okay, I am obsessed with this next top. It is the second one I bought. It's a baby doll style cold shoulder velvet green top. And I paired it with a leopard jegging for kind of an unexpected holiday look. Obviously, it would be so beautiful with just black leggings and like thigh high boots. Or you could go all out and just throw on some red pants and just be holly jolly. Um, I think it would be perfect with a shorter, real sparkly necklace it would kind of play off the sheen of the velvet and the jeggings were cute they were just basically leopard print jeggings they had a three button enclosure nice thick waistband the top was a double zero and it was 42.90 and the jeggings were a size 12 and they were 69.50 Okay, this last outfit that I have is a foil wrap style three quarter length top with the slim boot style jean. I wasn't crazy about the jeans for one. I don't know why, but the boot cut jeans are never the same quality, I feel like, as their 
like skinny jeans or their jeggings. I don't know. It it was weird. They were obviously big through the hip, which happens a good bit. And then for the first time ever, I had a gap in the back of my jeans, which literally never happens because I have a large waist. So they just fit strange and I wasn't a fan. The top was cute. I liked the foil texture. I think it would be super cute with some silver jewelry. Actually, the earrings that I got, those silver dangly earrings would look really pretty with it. But I would definitely pair this top more with a black pant or even those red like plaid ponty pants I had on with one of the other outfits. The top was on sale for $31.90 and a double zero, and the jeans were a size 12, $69.50. Thanks for watching, Curvy Mamas. See you next time.